Hi, Dan Clark from My Florida Dreams. Today we're down in Northport, seven miles south of Jacaranda, just two miles south of River Road, if you're familiar with the area at all. We're in Harbor Cove, beautiful community, 190 uh, acres here, two pools. They've got a 90 slip marina, nice, nice community, much like the place that I live in, Bay Indies. Wish we had a marina, but we don't, but they have that extra here as well. So just a beautiful home in the warm mineral springs area, if you're familiar with that as well. So this is on the Mayaka River. Uh, you don't quite see the river from this particular home, but the community is on the Mayaka River, which obviously leads out there into Charlotte Harbor. So if you're a boater looking for a boater community, that type of thing, hey, we got it here. You can talk to the office about one of the slips. I'm not sure what's available, but they do have 90 slips down there. So Harbor Cove, beautiful community. Uh, we're at 337 Blackburn road uh, boulevard excuse me uh in a it's a 12 by 56 1973 but we've got and gene's going to kind of pan this the living room is 18 feet wide here folks so it's not technically a true single wide we've got uh, another nice lanai out here off the front that we're going to show you in just a minute it's a two bedrooms one bath it has been remodeled it has been updated it is on the land lease community because harbor cove is resident owned and most of the lots you own in here you do have the option of buying this land here as well if you don't want to continue to rent it to 615 you buy it and your lot rent obviously drops down but it's a good opportunity for a snowbird who's looking to come down during that seven or eight thousand dollars annual at this fee here uh, so nice home so again this i want to point out 18 approximately feet i just pasted off i didn't have the tape measure with me but about 18 feet wide here little lower ceiling here kind of got like a bump out what you see in this home does come with a home so we got a sofa here uh, we do have a nice fireplace tv there um, we got the faux brick you paint that white that brighten that up uh, the darker paneling hey put a lighter shade on that as well these folks are just not finished up they've done new windows i want gene to point around here look if we look at this side here we've got not all new windows, but other than the front of the home over the kitchen and behind the couch, everything is a brand new window. So there's not much to finish up on there. Ceilings are good and high. We do have three ceiling fans in here as well. Floors, Gene point down at that. Nice laminate plywood. They put 5 8 plywood down underneath this, so it's all solid. There's no soft spots. Uh, again, nice wide area here. Open floor plan. Uh, we'll come over here into the kitchen. The kitchen's been done in just the last two to three years. We've got all brand new cabinets. Got a wrap around here. Again, all new cabinets, new countertop with a waterfall, beautiful black spot backsplash here, built-in microwave. Again, three years old here. Got some again, all brand new cabinets here for you. Uh, got a nice little pantry area over here. This little corner area would be a nice place for to put a little drop leaf table or something like that. Or if you wanted to add a countertop across there, could be a cook's kitchen with extra countertop. But there is a good countertop space here. The sink is new. Nice, bright and airy looking out here towards uh, the main entry to Blackburn. The marina would be down this way here. So again, this flooring all encompasses this whole living room kitchen area. Uh, again, nice little side space here as well. I want to point out too, this nice little, it's approximately 10 by 10, 9 by 10 uh, lanai, a uh, little corner of lanai out here facing the street as well. Um, this little set doesn't go with the home, but it is for sale if somebody wanted to add that or however you want to make an offer with it in there. So again, nice little lanai, got the uh, windows that go up and down uh, so you can open this up, get some fresh breezes, front door opens out as well to the road, nice little paver, nicely landscaped out here as well. Beautiful lawns here, they keep the place looking good. Palm needs to be trimmed, but that's not too much of an issue there. So nice nine by 10 approximately sitting area there off of that, so uh, nice space there. So again, beautiful, lots of space here in your kitchen, living room, everything's new here. Just need to do a little paint flavoring it your way if you watched any of my videos nice fan there as well let's walk down the hall we've got uh, two bedrooms we've got uh, some tile here going down the hall got two windows here look out to the carport it's got a beautiful carport two carport we'll show you that in a minute as well 
Got a smaller guest room here, but it is a guest room or an office or what would you like it to be? Uh, two new windows in there with a fan. Uh, again, AC is approximately six years old. The roof, roof was coated this year. They did remove the closets to make the rooms bigger, so you could add the closets back in, do whatever you want to do there. That's your call. Uh, just This is where the stack unit used to be, so now it's just an extra closet, broom closet. I'll show you the stack unit as we come down around the corner into the bathroom. Again, all new countertop. That feels like Corian there. Double sinks, big mirror here built in. The shower is all new. Newer toilet. Gene's going to come around the corner. I'll get out of his way. Your stack unit's right there. So your laundry is on the inside, folks. As most of you know, they're usually in the shed. If you wanted more room in here, it can go. It can be moved. Uh, but stack unit is inside. Got the same tile in here as well. But a nicely done up bathroom. Uh, they put the this stuff on the wall here as well so that uh, handle handle any moisture or anything in here like that as well so nicely done come in through to the back we're coming into the master uh, it has a murray electrical panel uh, looks to be in good shape there um, all set there so here's your master the, you could build a closet back in at some time. There was a closet here. There was a bureau here when they removed the bureau. They noticed that they hadn't done the floor, but here's evidence of that 5 8 plywood. There's three or four more boxes of this wood flooring out there. So if you wanted to finish this or add a corner uh, closet in here, you could. Again, we've got four new windows in here going both sides uh, as far as the east and the west side of the home. And we do have a closet here as well. So fan in the room, ceilings have been painted. Um, so two bedrooms, one bath or one bedroom in an office, what would you like to be? Updated bathroom, updated kitchen, flooring's been taken care of, appliances are done, roof's been done. Uh, out here, let me show you where you live most of the time when you're not sleeping or eating. We have a large uh, screen room here. I'm going to guess, oh, I don't know, it's probably 10 by 20, 10 by 18, somewhere in there. Uh, we have a 6 by 10 shed in here as well. The house has been painted on the outside. Uh, got a back door that goes out to a lawn area. And again, beautiful lawns down here. They, I, I wish they took good shape of the lawns in Bay Indies as they do down here. But beautiful lawns down here. They, they take great shape of that. Uh, got some blinds that come down if you want to block the sun. The big windstorm that we had about a month ago knocked this one down, but there is another one that can go up there, so this whole side can be blocked to the sun. Look at your carport. You've got two car covered action here. You could extend this if you wanted to and still have one, so you could even elongate this screen room if you wanted to, going out to that side. But here we are, 337 Blackburn, Harbor Cove, Northport, seven miles south of Venice. If you're looking for something, uh, this home's... Uh, value price folks for what they've done here and there isn't much that you've got to do if you want to throw a little paint at it bring some furniture in obviously because that type of thing but dan clark my florida dreams if you're a boater this is the community you ought to be in dan clark my florida dreams 207-807-7537 i say this a lot i mean it in this market it's not going to last folks give me a call